Hello everybody, welcome to the channel. And, uh, if it's your first time here, welcome. And if you're a returning visitor, thanks for stopping by again. Please help your brother out, press the like and subscribe button. It takes two seconds of your time. I just wanted to talk about the topic today of the difference between <clears throat> alone and loneliness. Alone and lonely. There's two different things. You see, when you're on your own, Someone can be looking upon your situation and they can be thinking, look at him, he's lonely, he ain't got anyone, and stuff like this. But there's a difference with being alone. Sometimes you're alone and you have everything you need. You have a good relationship with God, the Creator, the universe. You're working, working on your crafts. You're working on your projects and you don't exactly mind and to be honest you look at some kind of interactions as a distraction now it's not good to be just looking upon someone's situation and be thinking that they're lonely there's a big difference in it and when you when you in uh enable the power of solitude see solitude it can be one of two things you can either go one way with it and you can endure pain misery suffering being lonely or you embrace the power of solitude and you utilize that to the best of your advantages and each and every day you focus on your purpose you focus on your craft you focus on your projects. You focus on what needs to be done. Now these projects could be anything. It could be posting your beats on SoundCloud. It could be making music. You could be an artist. You could be a music artist. You could be an actual artist who likes drawing. You could be someone who writes poetry. You, it doesn't matter what your craft is. But as an individual, we all have the capability of creating something. We have the grand creator, the God, God that created everything in the heavens and the earth. But we also have us so we're like a smaller version we're able to create things too and that's what our capabilities are here to outlay and to pour forth into the right areas of our life so what i'd say any advice is don't listen to what other people think if you've got an idea you've got something that you want to do do it Go through the trial and errors without you picking up whatever it is to do. Without you planting that seed and actually going with that journey. It will always be something in your mind that you wish you could have done. But just, just keep trying, keep focusing and don't worry about what people think about you. There's a power in solitude. I don't know if you've heard of Nietzsche. Nietzsche went through periods of solitude where he perfected it. It's, it's, it's a very beautiful, you can perfect it. It's like an art. Practicing solitude is powerful. And you may only need to go through this experience for a couple of years or six months or whatever. You just, or maybe now and then, you go into your period of the solitude to recharge and re-energize and get back to the right mind state and stuff. Because it's, it's a beautiful thing. When you love your own company, you're basically setting yourself up for when you, do, you, you won't let anybody into your life because you're so content with what you're doing. You're focusing on your projects, you're busy, you're, making, you're, you're doing stuff with your time. You're learning, you're studying, you're watching YouTube videos, you're, you're educating yourself, you're, you're, you're reading books, you're doing stuff. Basically, when the right character and the right person comes into your life, you'll know about it. Instead of just settling for an everyday, just to anybody. That low-hanging fruit that I've talked about in previous videos, like just ready to settle for anyone just because you just want to be with someone. But God made us as individuals, God made us to be solitary creatures too there's a lot of um with social media and stuff 
it's, it's causing isolation too. But don't feel isolated. Don't feel lonely. It will perfect the power of solitude and the art of being alone. And I'll catch you soon in the next video. Help you.